Hi everyone, my name is Ife Dayo and I'm a Nigerian beauty blogger based in Lagos. Here on my YouTube channel, I share makeup reviews, skincare reviews and some lifestyle content and jewelry content. So if you'd like to see more of that, please don't forget to subscribe. In today's video, I'll be doing a review of one of Polar's Choice's recently released products and that is the Omega Complex Cleansing Balm. I'll be sharing my thoughts about this cleansing balm, a demo of new year Pros, cons, and all of that good stuff. So, if you'd like to see more of that, please keep on watching. I will be starting off by reading out the description on the website, and it is described on the Polar's Choice website as a triple action cleansing balm made with omega 3, 6, and 9 to cleanse, soften, and soothe while rinsing completely clean. This fragrance free formulation contains a barrier repairing complex of fatty acids that condition the skin while preventing moisture loss during cleansing. This softening, natural <laughs> this softening naturally emollient ingredients clean without feeling greasy and rinse easily with water. So that is what it is described as on the Polar's Choice website and upon buying the product it looks like this. Comes in this nice tube packaging and contains 3.5 ounces or 103 ml of products. Upon opening it, it has a thick balm, balm consistency that has no scent. Mm. Upon applying it on the fingers and rubbing it in between the in between the fingers, it, it kind of melts and emulsifies when it comes when you rub it in between, your, in between your fingers or when it comes in contact with your skin. It feels really good on the skin. Does not feel heavy. Um, tacky or, uncomf or uncomfortable when you apply it on the skin. Onto the ingredient list, this cleansing balm contains ojoba seed oil, rape seed oil and middle foam seed, middle foam seed oil, all of which contain fatty acids which help um, serve as emollients and also have antioxidant effects as well. These, um, these fatty acids are also help to moisturize the skin and keep the skin really soft during the cleansing process and after the cleansing process. On to the effects as a cleanse, as a first cleanser or as a cleansing balm. How does it work as a cleansing balm? I think it works beautifully as a cleansing balm to take out both sunscreen and makeup. It helps really, really take out all of that, all of those um, impurities and sunscreen from your skin in the night. It works beautifully as a first cleanser. Uh, it takes out all makeup and rinses completely clear. It even takes up um, liquid liner, graphic liner, water activated liner, and all of that good stuff, which I really appreciate in the cleansing balm. I also like the fact that I don't have to tug around my face to get makeup out or to get um, grime and dirt out. I also do not have to talk too much around my eyes to get out my eye makeup. It does not sting my eyes and it rinses out completely clear upon applying water. You can also use a clean cloth, a wet cloth to take out um, the dirt but I prefer to rinse it out and it rinses completely clear and more importantly does not leave a film after rinsing it out. It costs $28 for 3.5 ounces of product which I think is a great deal especially because it's hard to find good cleansing balms that are formulated well, do not leave a film and actually take out all kinds of makeup. When I mean all kinds of makeup, take out liners, take out foundation, take out full coverage makeup, not just light coverage, tinted moisturizer kind of makeup. So I think it's a really good price for what you're getting. In conclusion, what do I think about this cleansing balm? Do I think it's worth your coins? Totally worth your coins. I think it's a good cleansing balm that has a good ingredient list with fatty acids that have antioxidant effects and also works really well as it should as a cleansing balm and a first cleanser. Rinses out completely clear without leaving a film. I totally recommend it and if you're on the market or looking out for a cleansing balm or a first cleanser to buy, I would totally recommend this one. It's really nice and it contains a decent amount and will last you quite some time. I'll be leaving a demo next next um, showing you guys how it's applied and how it took off my makeup and took out my liner and all of that good stuff in the next frame so you guys can watch that and see how dancing balm performed
Well, that's it about this short video. I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope you answered any questions you may have about the Polar Choice Omega Plus Cleansing Balm. If you have any questions, please don't forget to leave your questions or comments in the comment section below. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to watch my other videos, which I will link here and here for you to check out and watch. Please don't forget to subscribe once again, and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.